Okay, this is just a quick, um, short little lesson on uh, D-Lights, Groovers in the Heart. And this is just the bass line for the riff that basically goes through most of the song anyway. There's only a short little bit where it... Uh, and that's sort of it. But it starts on B, on A flat. Alright, so you're on the fourth fret, as you can see. One, two, three behind the fourth fret and we're going starting on the A flat note we're going down two strings now when you when you actually go down there to this this one here you can keep that finger on okay because you go hit that then you go down See how you can, right? You can leave that finger on because it plants it there. So we're using the A flat on the fourth, right? That's the top string on the fourth fret. We're going down to the second string on the fourth fret. Then we're going to the third string on the sixth fret then we're going up here to the sixth fret on the second string all right so we're getting that going back down to the second string on the fourth fret third string on the sixth fret and then down to the fourth string on the third fourth fret sorry on the third string so we get that okay see so I mean fourth string fourth fret second string fourth fret third string sixth fret 2nd string 6th fret, 2nd string 4th fret, 3rd string 6th fret, and 3rd string 4th fret. So we get that. And then we go, the second part is, we go down here, we go, this is actually your 1st string, we go right down to the 4th fret there, and we do a similar thing again, we can keep that finger down, going 1st string 4th fret, 2nd string 6th fret, then 1st string 6th fret, fret, and then we do a little chromatic where we go to the 4th fret and go, and we just, you don't have to pluck that, you can just hammer on. So I'm plucking it to start with, and then just hammering my fingers on. And they're good things to practice. Alright? So you put it all together, you get... Okay? So, and again... I'm actually rolling my hand there. If you notice, it just makes it quicker. See how I... You see it again? All right, because I can actually mute it. See, my finger's actually touching the string and helping to mute that, that string so it doesn't ring open after I've moved my finger. And you can do the same down here. So, and up to speed, it's probably about a...
that's it. 